You may want to have a Facebook like or recommend button on every page of your website. For example, in the header area. So that on every page that you visit, you see the Facebook like or recommend button. The standard code works great unless some of your pages are secure using the HTTPS protocol. E-commerce websites like Else Inc. here in this example are the most common example. This is an easy fix for domains such as Facebook that support SSL. To avoid browsers SSL warnings that create high anxiety for your visitors, don't specify the transport protocol. So let me give you some examples of the warnings that you might get. So on this website, if I click sign in, you will see that the HTTPS protocol here is showing, but we don't see any secure information here in the address bar. A better example might be in Internet Explorer. If I do the same action and click sign in, which goes to the secure page, I get the security warning, which lets me know that there's some mixed content on this page. Some of it's secure and some of it's not. So if I just want to say right here that, you know, let's just get rid of the insecure information and view the rest, you can see now that we can't see the Facebook like button. So we're able to use the page, but um, we, we created some high anxiety for the user by making them see that warning and clicking that. A lot of times this is going to send them off your web page using another web, a website or going back to Google. So in order to avoid this problem, it's a very easy fix. So let's look at the code that Facebook gives us. They give us this code wrapped in an iframe and you will see here that in that code the protocol HTTP colon is, is specified here. So what we're going to do is actually just remove the HTTP colon so that we just have the two forward slashes and then I'm going to upload that to my server and we're going to go back to our examples first we're going to look at Firefox so we'll see what happens when we click sign in now that the new code has been uploaded we can see that the security information is now listed up here in the address bar and then let's take a look at Internet Explorer now what happens when we click on sign in on Internet Explorer? You will see that we did not get the security warning and now the Facebook like still shows in the header area.